Hey guys and welcome back, it's Tinker Taylor here and today I am doing a bit of an interesting build. Um, I recently got gifted some new packs and I thought that I would go through and just do a build using only base game and a uh, dream home decorator. It's a very, uh, feels like an Ikea inspired build. So that's pretty much what it is. It's just a little, little house. Uh, I didn't want to do anything too big, but I also didn't want to do too small. So yeah, that's pretty much the vibe for this build. Um, and I'm actually really, really happy with it. I think it looks really, um, and I guess the other, another reason why I'm kind of doing an IKEA inspired sort of build is, well, as some of you may know, I'm going to be moving soon. Um, update on that, uh, there may be a place available. Oh, sorry for around but I do live with a bunch of other people uh but yeah we I should be getting a call hopefully tomorrow finding out if we have the place that we've applied for I'd just be beyond happy if we got it but yeah um I've been looking at furniture and all that sort of nonsense, so it kind of makes sense that I've used that as an inspiration for this. Um, now upstairs the bathroom looks kind of strange because I had an idea for it that I really wanted to do. And when we get to it you'll see that. Well, you won't exactly see what I was going to do. I will explain it, but I, I saw an image of something that I was like, wow, I really want to reproduce that. Because someone had made a really wonderful, amazing looking bathroom. So I kind of wanted to create my own version of it. But since I was only using base game and dream home decorator, I could not. So I do adjust the bathroom up. But I'm honestly in love with it. I think it is. Oh, it's just so sweet and simple. And I I really tried to take myself in this build with all of the lighter coloured woods because I do prefer a darker wood. Um you know, a rich, dark sort of coloured wood. I, I went with a lot of lighter woods this time, and boy, did I have fun messing around with all the different modular bits, sticking them together and whatnot. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I love that we can mix and match and do whatever we want with these. Um... Yeah, so I had a little bit of fun adjusting my, I guess you'd keep my usual style. But I do still think I played it fairly safe. I mean, that wallpaper. <laughs> that wallpaper is a bit, uh, a bit out there. And I do use it quite a bit in this build. But I think it looks good. To be honest, if any of you don't like it, you can go off get one of the build to the gallery. Um Yeah, I'm I I'm gonna be so awfully busy over the next couple of weeks that I'm not a hundred percent sure I'm gonna be able to get some videos out. Uh, but I am going to put out an old video, well not an old video, but an old build, 
Oh, I'll get back to that in a second. In the bathroom here, I wanted to put a shower, one of the freestanding showers, but because I'm not using any other pack, I couldn't put it in there, and I wanted to have this really amazing looking, like, in shower with a bath in it. Well, but that didn't happen, but I'm still very pleased with this bathroom. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, I'm going to be very busy over the next couple of weeks with exams and packing and moving and all. All of the fun stuff that goes on with that. So I might either skip a few builds, a few videos, or I might. Oh, I don't know. I have. I really haven't decided what I'm going to do. I really don't want to skip out on videos because I really enjoy making them. So if I can fit them in, I will. But if I can't, that my that'll be here. I think it should just be the next two weeks. Mainly the issue. Um. So if I have to miss one or two years, I might have to just do that because I don't think it's feasible for me to do all the things that I need to be able to do and videos out. However, I will try to get them out because you know I, I will still need some time to myself to relax and de-stress so maybe I will do this as a, a way to de-stress um and it really just depends on how much of my other stuff I may if I can get a lot of my other stuff done before a video is due then I might go ahead and do one and upload it but if I'm really far behind or whatever and I need to Pay more attention to that. That, to me, is more important. So I will definitely do that. Um, but it should just be the next two weeks. Otherwise, after that, I should be a lot more free. Not proper English, but... You get what I mean. Uh, I should be able to um, produce much higher quality videos than some of the ones I've been producing, and I should also be able to uh, not be rushing them or feel stressed about it. So I am excited for that. Uh, and I'm excited that I'm, you know, getting to a point where. I'm really happy with my builds and the whole process and all that sort of stuff, so. And I hope you guys are enjoying it too. Uh, I used to get a few comments here and there, and not so much anymore, but yeah. Um, also, uh, um, I don't know if any of you guys know this, but I do have a Discord and an Instagram, both the links be in the description below and a uh, link to my channel so if you're keen for either of those make sure you check them out because I'm pretty keen about them put a lot of effort into the discord so I'll tell you that um and I know one day I'll be looking for moderators but at the moment I think I can handle it because there's I think two other people <laughs> which isn't really that much which is why i don't need moderators at the moment but i know in the future i'm going to be looking out for moderators so yeah keep an eye out for that i guess if any of you have discord and if any of you have instagram i do post some photos of my builds on, on instagram Normally, the day after I post the build. Uh, I don't know why the day after. I haven't exactly sorted out my uh, Instagram schedule yet. And sometimes, some weeks, I just I have I didn't post. So I'm gonna try and uh, work on that because it 
would probably be beneficial if it was a bit more consistent. Um, but other than that, really all I have to say. Um, let me know in the comments down below how busy your lives get and how you keep track of everything. How you on top of it is. I would love some pointers and how to keep on top of everything because sometimes things can get a bit hectic and above. Um, I don't know, just a little bit out of control. But yeah, other than that, uh, I'd say also let me know now below what your favorite part of the build was. And I guess that's pretty much it. So here are the screenshots. Uh, <laughs> it was a bit dark that day but yeah this is the downstairs i'm absolutely in love with it it's very ikea-esque um very spacious and very lots of storage very simple as well um the bedroom again very simple lots of storage or a decent amount of storage i probably would have put a little bit more detail on one of those walls but yeah here's the bathroom nice and simple again and yeah then the floor plans um so yeah uh thank you guys for coming to watch really appreciate that uh give me a comment down below again what's your favorite part how do you keep early life and i will see you guys next time yeah